In this video, we will continue the explanation on how to transfer an ArchiCAD model into Unity. In the previous video, we already converted our ArchiCAD model into Cinema 4D format. However, there were no questions asked and everything was converted in the background. We cannot make changes directly in Unity, but we can edit the Cinema 4D file. Sometimes models don't come in correctly or need more editing. We had occasional mapping errors where texture ran messed up, scaled wrongly for certain parts of the model. We can also not define animations from within ArchiCAD. So if you want to include them, it should be done inside Cinema 4D. However, this would lead us too far in this video, so we focus on the texture mapping. We might occasionally have incorrect texture mapping applied to some objects, which can be corrected inside Cinema 4D. Double click on the model inside Unity to open Cinema 4D with this project. Most mapping problems can be solved by applying cubic rather than default UVW mapping. Usually, you would use the length and tiles parameter inside Cinema 4D texture tag to adjust the scaling for this object. But as we experienced, this modification is not retained in the conversion to Unity. So we need to use another method. Switch to the texture editing mode and activate the enable axis option. Now we can scale the gizmo, the cubic gizmo, to the 33 centimeters in all directions. This modification does not adjust the length and tiles parameter and will be retained when going to back to Unity. Save the Cinema 4D model and switch back to Unity. After a short while, the model in Unity is updated with the new texture coordinates. In the last two videos, we explained how we could convert an ArchiCAD model into Unity by using Cinema 4D and the Exchange add-on as an intermediate conversion tool. The same workflow can be established with Factorworks and Cinema 4D or, if you prefer, Autodesk software where you can combine AutoCAD or Revit with 3ds Max. In the next video, we will review the model update process, as this is an essential aspect of our visualization workflow with Unity.